Are you looking for the top best gaming video card? What's up everyone, in this video we will talk about the best gaming video card you can buy on Amazon. Please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for more videos. This list is based on my personal opinion and research and lists them based on quality features and pricing. If you want more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned be sure to check the links in the description below. Get one of the top graphics cards on the market to handle today's most demanding games. With one of them powering your computer, you'll be able to handle any game, as well as video editing, at high resolutions. Getting a new generation GPU has never been more affordable, due to AMD's big Navi and Nvidia's RTX 3000 series. Whatever path you choose, you'll need one of the top graphics cards to have an immersive and flawless experience. Whether you're working on a major project in Adobe Premiere or spending hours playing one of the top PC games, you'll find a GPU that can handle it. I have prepared this video guide for the best gaming video card so let's get started. 5 colon Gigabyte GeForce RTX 3090 When it comes to performance, the Nvidia GeForce RTX 3090 is unrivaled. With a huge 24 gigabytes of RAM, no game or, more critically, any graphics intensive project would run slowly. In reality, the 3090 can deliver 8K performance at 60 frames per second. It's an extraordinarily pricey gadget that's also quite large, so most people won't be able to afford it. The NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3090 is essentially a Titan replacement, therefore it's aimed at the creative user who works with demanding 3D and video rendering rather than a casual gamer. Despite this, it is significantly less expensive than the Titan, even if it remains beyond of most people's reach. 4 colon IVGA GeForce RTX 3080 the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3080 has made 4K gaming much more accessible. Previously, the RTX 2080D required more than $1,000 pound $1,000 to get playable frame rates. However, owing to the RTX 3080, the cost of 4K gaming has been dropped in half with the latest generation of NVIDIA graphics cards. It offers one of the most significant generational leaps in GPU history with a 50-80% performance boost over the RTX 2080 and a 20-30% performance improvement over the RTX 2080T, all while maintaining the same pricing point as the RTX 2080. If you have a little extra cash laying around, this is both an amazing powerhouse of a graphics card and a wonderful deal. 3 colon Sapphire Radeon Pulsar X5600 XT I was astounded by the size of the Sapphire Pulsar X5600 XT out of the package as I was by the Radeon RX5500 XT the first time I saw it. The backlit Sapphire logo on the side of the card facing the panel is the only difference in appearance between the two cards. The RX5600 XT's shroud, on the other hand, is even longer than the Sapphire RX5500 XT's 9.15 inch display. It takes up just over another inch of area in our test bed measuring 10.53 inches end-to-end, -end, which we hope translates to lower temperatures as we get into heat testing later on. Looking at AMD's press materials, it appears that this will be one of the smallest versions in the stack. Third-party makers like Asus and Gigabyte are going for broke, creating tri-fan variants for a card that might theoretically be as small as Zodax Twin Fan GeForce GTX 1660 Super. Look elsewhere, world of compact PC builders, this is not the GPU for you. 2 colon NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3060T With the launch of the GeForce RTX 30 series of graphics cards, NVIDIA has been on a tier, so much so that finding one in stock has been like following Sasquatch. With the unveiling of its new GeForce RTX 3060T Founders Edition mid-range GPU, the business hopes to continue its hot streak, and tour its sales. I was greeted by the familiar RTX 30 Series Founders Edition graphics card facelift when I pulled out the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3060T. The twin push-pull fan configuration, reduced PCB, and new heatsink that fills in the holes where the PCB used to reside in the RTX 20 Series Founders Edition cards are all present. NVIDIA's 12-pin power connector is back on the card's top edge, and it accepts an adapter that converts a regular 8-pin power supply line into this smaller, proprietary input. 1 colon IVGA GeForce RTX 3070 The GeForce RTX 3070 continues the Ampere onslaught and next generation architectural march. It's a significant downgrade from the 3080, with only half the VRAM of AMD's RX 6800 series cards. The 3070, on the other hand, is less expensive than AMD's new GPUs while still providing superior ray tracing performance and DLSS. 
it's a shame that all of the 3070 cards are expected to sell out for a long time. For $100 extra, the new RTX 3070T offers slightly higher performance, but it also consumes 30% more power, so we recommend sticking with the non-T card for now. So guys this was the video about the best gaming video card. All the links are given in the description, do check them out. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like button. Tell us in the comments section about which one you like the most and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thank you.